hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to talk about map interface in java so unlike uh, collection interfaces like uh, set queue and uh, list this is different uh, so it stores uh, the value uh, on the basis of key key and value pair okay so a map contains value on the basis of key that is key and value pair each key and value pair is known as an entry okay a map continue uh, contains unique keys so these are these are the properties of map interface a map doesn't allow duplicate keys but you can have duplicate values okay and hash map and linked hash map allow null values uh, null keys and values but tree map doesn't allow any null key or value okay so this is about uh, uh, map interface so let me just take you to the diagram which we have created earlier the hierarchy so this is the hierarchy so this is the map interface so there are three classes which implements a map interface uh, they are uh, hash map uh, linked hash map and hash table okay and there is another class tree map which uh, implements sorted map which extends map interface okay sorted map is uh, an interface here okay let's come back here map interface so let's talk about different classes so hash map class okay so these are the different properties of uh, hash map class so let me create the hash map class first and then we'll see what are the different properties hash map class demo so hash map so it will contain the values uh, on the basis of key and value pair okay so let me take key as integer and value as string okay and i'll give object name as hm using new keyword we'll create the object hash map like this okay we have to import hash map class from java.util package now let's insert the values okay so yeah this is how we can create so key and value pair okay so i have taken key as integer and string as value okay so this is my object name so let me just create so we have put method here to insert the values so let's talk about uh, student data so we can store uh, roll number as keys here so let's store one and i'll give the name as gems so let me copy paste so this is key two here i'll give peter this i'll give alvin and here i'll give john okay now let's print the values oh sorry third and fourth so here we go james peter alvin and john so let's see the properties so java hash map class contains only unique keys okay suppose you want to make this again so this entry again though so it won't take another entry okay so it will take only four entries here and class may have one null key and multiple null values so let's first see uh, one null key it will take only one null key okay so let me just create two null keys here so i'll give this as null null john one john two so we'll see so here we go it will take only one null key here okay this one okay 
and multiple null values so it will it it can contain multiple null values so let me make it five and six here and i'll make this as null i'll make this null again so it will take both the null values so no problem with that you can see five and six null null okay and another thing is hash map class is uh, non synchronized so this is not synchronized okay means it, uh, it is not thread safe and another thing is java hash map class maintains no order so so if you can see let me put this on top and print it again so here we go so this is my order the fourth key I have inserted first but it will di uh, display the first one second third fourth five and six like that okay so it does not maintain the insertion order so this is uh, about uh, hash map so how to iterate it okay so let me so we can iterate we have to convert this uh, into set using uh, map dot entry method okay and there are two methods we have get value get key, get key and get value method so using that and them we can retrieve the keys and values so let me use advanced for loop here map map dot entry and here we have to provide integer because we have integer keys and uh, string as values string values okay and here i have give i have to give some reference variable and my map sorry double colon and map object dot entry set method is there okay uh, so whatever uh, values key values will be there which will be retrieved by this entry set method and it will be stored in this map dot entry uh, uh, what you can say collection so in the form of integer and string okay keys and values so let me just give a print statement here okay keys uh, so we have data dot get key and uh, we have uh, uh, value is okay so we have data dot get value method uh, the first method okay now let me just print it so here you can see key is one value is gems key is two value is peter so like that we can iterate okay so this is all about uh, hash map so let's talk about uh, linked hash map so these are the different properties so let me just copy copy this class and paste it over here and we'll save it as a linked hash map linked hash map class demo linked hash map class demo okay and i'll change this to linked hash map linked linked hash map okay now we'll see different properties so same like uh, hash map uh, linked hash map may have one null key and multiple null values okay and it is non synchronized and it maintains insertion order okay so we'll see that so let me print it so if you can see uh, the fourth key is John so it will print John first 
in uh, here also okay so it maintains the insertion order so this is about a linked hash map class okay so the only difference is uh, it maintains insertion order okay another one is a tree map class so let me just copy paste this one copy this and paste it over here so we'll create tree map tree map class tree map class okay so what is the difference it maintains ascending order okay uh, so this is the difference okay and another thing is cannot have a null key but can have multiple null values it does not allow null keys as well whereas uh, whereas we have seen in uh, uh, hash map and linked hash map that they are allowed one null key but here in tree map it doesn't allow a single null key as well okay so let's talk about first that one so let me make it null here and let's let's comment this one sorry let me change this to tree tree map and tree map okay now let me just run it so here it will give null pointer exception because we have we, we are trying to access we have trying we are trying to give null uh, null as key values okay so it, it won't take that so let me just uncomment this and we'll provide some values key here fifth key so let me run it so it will take both null values this time so both null values will be started here okay and uh, it maintains ascending order okay so ascending order means it will uh, give based on the keys uh, ascending order first second third fourth fifth and sixth okay so let me give this at the top and we'll see here we go it will still uh, prints the value on the basis of key ascending order okay so this is my ascending order of the keys first second third fourth fifth and sixth okay so these are the uh, different properties of tree map and last we have uh, hash table okay so let me just copy this and let me create another class Hash table class demo. Table. Oh, sorry, I have saved here. I have to open hash table here. Hash table and uh, here we'll give hash table and here as well now let's talk about the hash table so hash table internally contains buckets in which it stores key value pairs okay so there is a bucket in which it stores uh, key and value pairs okay the hash table uses the key hash code to determine to which bucket the key value pair should map so there is a concept of hash code hash code is a method which which returns integer value so we'll talk about the hash code uh, functionality later on so based on that it will uh, it determines the value and it stores 
is an array of list each list is known as a bucket so the position of the bucket is defined by calling the hash code method okay so the basically it tells about the bucket position okay so a hash table contains value based on the key java hash table contains class contains unique elements so this is first thing so let's talk about it unique elements means let me just use this here so let me just comment the null values So here you, you can see it stores uh, unique keys. Okay, Java hash table doesn't allow null key or values. So let me check first null value. So it doesn't allow null value. So let me try null key. So it doesn't allow null key as well okay what else java hash table class is synchronized okay so this is thread safe and it doesn't maintain any order as well so let me just uh, comment this so you can see this is printed first four three two one okay so this is about uh, hash table so you can see the difference like in hash table it doesn't allow a null key or values it doesn't allow a single null key or any values okay and in tree map uh, it cannot have a null key but can have multiple null values okay same like uh, uh, linked hash map and hash map okay they are allowed uh, one null key okay but it doesn't allow a null key but it allows multiple null values okay and linked hash map maintains insertion order so this is the difference and here it does not maintain any insertion order hash map so this is all about uh, map interface and associated classes uh, with map interface okay so thank you guys for watching have a nice day. Bye-bye.